On December 9, 2022, based on information from German government officials, the German newspaper Handelsblatt reported that Rheinmetall would be supplying Skynex to Ukraine. However, the inclusion of these systems in a list of equipment being supplied to Kiev was made public in a press release on June 27, 2023. This announcement came after the Netherlands placed an order for 14 Leopard 2A4 tanks, which both the Netherlands and Denmark are procuring for Ukraine. Prior to this report, on the same day as December 9th, Rheinmetall had only announced in a press release that they had secured a contract to supply the two Skynex air defense systems for the international customer by the end of 2023. The total value of the delivery, including the Skynex systems and HX trucks to be supplied with them, was estimated to be 182 million euros, or equal to 199.77 million US dollars. As per the details shared on Ukrainian Prime Minister Denis Shmyha's Telegram account on April 26, 2022, the German Skynex air defense cannon and missile systems are currently in active service in Ukraine, deployed to counter Russian aerial threats. <laughs> Additionally, Ukraine is contemplating the option of collaborating in the production of certain components for these systems. So, what exactly is Skynex system and how does it operate? The Skynex is a short-range air defense system which was introduced during the 35mm Air Defense Systems Group event in 2021. The core of this air defense system is the Erlikon Skymaster Battle Management System, which serves as the control node. It allows for the modular integration of various sensors and effectors, tailored to meet specific mission requirements. The Skynex system features a truck-mounted version and is specifically developed with lightweight and mobile design. Therefore, the Skynet system is particularly well-suited for short and very short-range air defense capabilities where guided missiles may be ineffective. The standard version of Skynex can engage various threats, including aircraft, cruise missiles, tactical drones of varying sizes, air-to-ground missiles, as well as mortars and artillery rockets at distances up to 2.5 miles. This feature makes Skynex an optimal solution for safeguarding critical stationary assets, like military and civilian infrastructures, including airfields, military bases, harbors, bridges, and nuclear power plants, against aerial attacks in diverse weather conditions both day and night. The primary configuration of the Skynex system comprises up to four remote-controlled Erlikon Revolver Gun MK3, the Erlikon Twin Gun GDF-009 trio, surface-to-air missiles, active and passive electronic warfare capabilities, and even potential future high-energy lasers. The unmanned revolver gun MK3 offers a remarkable combination of precision and firepower, capable of firing up to 1,000 rounds per minute. This is because the revolver gun MK3 uses advanced hit efficiency and destruction, or ahead 35mm programmable rounds, which are more cost-effective than comparable guided missile-based systems and are not susceptible to interference or jamming by electronic countermeasures when fired. This programmable ahead 35mm ammunition further enables the Skynet to effectively hit even the smallest of targets. The Skynex system to be delivered to Ukraine is based on a six-by-six -six man truck with a crew cabin situated at the front and an Erlikon revolver gun MK3 weapon station mounted at the rear of the truck chassis. Equipped with its sensor unit, which includes a tracking radar, TV, IR camera, and laser range finders, the gun can independently take control of any air targets within its range, as designated by Skymaster. The Skynex unit utilizes several medium-range radars, 
including the Erlikon XTAR 3D tactical acquisition radar, to gather the air picture, which is then processed at the control node. Specifically, the XTAR 3D is a tactical acquisition radar operating in the X band and capable of performing various missions in three dimensions. The radar's functions include search, detection, acquisition, tracking, and identification of both high and low altitude air targets, thereby providing the Skynex control node with a comprehensive three dimensional air picture. On the other hand, the Skynex Control Node 1 is housed within a 20-feet container and contains the necessary computers, operator consoles, power supply, air conditioning, protection, and communication systems for the SkyMaster Battle Management System. It offers the operators all the essential command and control functionalities required to effectively carry out their air defense missions. This encompasses control over connected weapons and sensors, targeting, and firing. Now let's look at the effective ranges and altitudes covered by the Skynet system. The engagement range and altitude capabilities of the Skynet system vary depending on the specific components in use. The Erlikon Skyranger gun, a 35mm revolver cannon, and the Orlikon Twin Gun, a dual-barreled remote-controlled weapon station equipped with two 35mm guns, typically have an effective range of up to 2.5 miles and can engage targets at altitudes of up to 9,842 feet. Also, depending on types of the targets, the 35mm cannon can reach a maximum firing range of 2.2 miles when engaging the aerial ones, while for land targets it extends to 3.2 miles. The surface-to-air missiles incorporated in Skynex system also have variable ranges and altitude capabilities, depending on the type of missile utilized. For instance, the Rheinmetall Erlikon surface-to-air missile, or ROSOM, boasts an effective range of up to 3.7 miles and can engage targets at altitudes of up to 16,404 feet. On the other hand, other missiles like the AIM-9X Sidewinder can reach an effective range of up to 21.7 miles and engage targets at higher altitudes. In terms of its multi-mission radar, which is responsible for detecting, tracking, and classifying aerial targets, the Skynex system typically has a detection range of approximately 12 to 18 miles, and some sources say that the radar's detection range spans from 12 to 32 miles. However, this range may vary depending on the specific configuration of the radar and the size of the target. Finally, the Skynex air defense system can operate independently or be seamlessly integrated into a larger air defense network, thanks to its modular design, which allows for easy upgrades and adaptation to diverse threat scenarios. That's all. Thanks for watching.